this episode of Walking Dead. I won't be talking too long. Is Greg Nicotero and, and Robert Kirkland trying to get the show canceled? An episode. Tara gets an episode. A Tara episode. In the thick of the saviors and all that's going on, Tara gets an episode. They've been gone since the satellite thing. Since last season and stuff. They've been gone. And they get an episode. Her and Dr. Dre. <clears throat> and he, where, where did he disappear to? Where did he disappear to? He gonna die. He gonna die soon. He's, he's the new actor on the new 24 that's gonna be on Fox. So I'm pretty sure they're gonna kill him off on Walking Dead. Did he just disappear? Are they gonna kill him? What? What? The little civilization that she, she crawled up on a bunch of women. That got away from Negan. And all the men got killed. And they fishing and stuff. This was a terrible episode. Terrible episode. Terrible time to show the episode. In the thick of things. This just a lull. In the whole show. You, that's like. Could you imagine. How watching the whole episode of Power. Watching my two episodes of Power. And you don't see Ghost. Could you could you imagine? Just is that the way that the Walking Dead try not to pay some of their top characters in it? Is that how they try not to pay Daryl and uh and Rick the big dollars like like other shows? Cause at at one point like Seinfeld was getting paid a million dollars episode. I think Charlie Sheen was getting paid two million dollars an episode for uh for his little show and stuff uh. Is that how The Walking Dead is trying not to pay their characters? By badly putting, badly putting them in episodes. Scattering the actors out over the episodes. Like every three episodes, your favorite character going to show their face. So out of 16 episodes, they get, they get maybe five, six episodes. This was terrible. I, I don't have... Towards the end... I'm trying to think of something positive to say. It was positive the way you... Mm, no. Mm. And, she, and she gained a whole bunch of weight. They were starving on the road. They didn't have nothing to eat and stuff. But she got fatter. And she was trying to run. And she was just jiggling everywhere. She barely could run. And she's supposed to be like part of the powerful crew. Her... She's from Rick and them group. They're so strong and stuff. And she does not come off like that. No, no, no sorry. No sorry. I hate to be sexist or whatever. And it's not that it was a female lead. Like, I, if this a Carol episode, well, let's go. A, a Michonne episode, let's go. A Tara episode. I like to keep these things up and I like to talk about the episode and what happened and stuff. But to be honest, this episode, I rather would have watched uh, Sunday Night Football, even the BET Soul Train Awards. I should have watched that instead of watching The Walking Dead. And I seen an article saying how it's like a record of viewership, how the show is falling, falling down. It's still getting... A lot of viewers, way more than a lot of shows, but the first episode had 17 million viewers. And like the last episode had 11 million. So, a 6 million drop off. And it keeps plummeting. I see why. I see why. And Robert Kirkland and them, are they getting tired of doing the show? Or are they trying to get it canceled? I said that at the beginning, but this is just occurring to me. Are they trying to sabotage themselves? You remember when Chappelle was on top of his game and he was just like, I'm I don't want to do this anymore. But you don't see too many white people do that. 
Like, they try to ride it out to the end. But are they trying to sabotage it because the workload is getting too much? Are they trying to get away from this? Uh, Kanye is one of the most successful artists in the world, and he's having a mental breakdown. Is Robert Kirkland and them the expectations of greatness towards The Walking Dead is that getting to them? Because they're almost, they're almost out of comic books to draw from. Because after this, they're going to have the Whisperers, and after that, it's over. It's pretty much, the show has nothing to pull from. They're going to have to start out fresh because they're coming up on the Whisperers. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, going to be the greatest or the most hated. I have nothing, nothing more to say about this episode. This episode sucked.